end of the day, all that matters is, uh, you know, uh, we winning and I'm not, you know, seriously injured. So that's that's the main important thing. Uh, so it's just all about, you know, getting getting to the training room, making sure my body is is right for, for next week and uh, I'll be ready to go next Sunday. Justin, tell us about the touchdown. I mean, that's got to be the ball that as an NFL wide receiver, you lay in bed at night dreaming about. <laughs> for sure. Uh, I mean, we practiced that play time and time again. I mean, we didn't practice it being on the three yard line <laughs> and that's going 97. But uh, I mean, it was just a, a great, great ball by Sam uh, to, to really trust the double team and uh, for, for me to, to, to run right through it. So uh, it, it's, it's been time and time again where, you know, we, we practice these plays and uh, we just got to go out here and execute them. So it, it's going to happen all, over and over again, just like I've been saying, me beating the double team. Uh, you know, Sam just got to trust me to, to, to beat it and, and, and to make a big play. Did you need Jalen down there to get you in it? Could you gotten in on your own? <laughs> yeah, I got, got in by myself. <laughs> but I always will appreciate the extra, uh, extra help. I mean, I mean just that, that effort for him to run down there uh, to give me that block. I mean, it just shows you uh, the, the amount of selfishness that we don't have on this team. Uh, but, I mean, that's my guy. That's, that's my bro. And, uh, you know, if I did need it, I'm glad he was there to help me. <laughs> how, how did you make that decision on, you know, you did the Sutter step to 32 to go the other way? Like, how how did you um, sort of make sure that you're going to make it all the way across? There? Yeah, um, it's all about just being patient yeah. throughout the route, um, knowing how, how, how to get to one spot, get to the other spot, and, and just running out of my route. Um, it's just, you know, just attacking the leverages. Uh, we we kind of understood what they was going to play. Uh, towards that type of route scheme. Uh, so it was just, you know, just calling the right play at the right time um, in, the, in the perfect defense. And uh, Sam just, you know, landed out there for me to go get it. Justin, you mentioned Sam trusting you, but how much are you guys trusting Sam too? That's a tough spot, you know, in with the back against the goal line to really decide to go for it all in that in that spot and just trusting him to make the right decision. And Yeah, I, I mean, Sam has been making a whole bunch of uh, great decisions. Um, I mean, we just got to keep trusting in him to make those decisions. Um, I mean, we have guys around him to, to help him out a, a little bit, uh, you know, give him a little bit less pressure. Uh, but I, I feel like O-line helped tremendously with that confidence that he had uh, to stand there back in the pocket and give an extra uh, a hitch or two and uh, to lay that ball up. So uh, all around, it was just a dominant performance by our whole entire team. Uh, we just got to carry that same energy every single week. Justin Jones confidence with his second touchdown in two games. Yeah, I, I, we've kind of been preaching to Speedy this whole entire week that uh, you know we we know that Speedy is going to be that guy for us. Uh, you know we have so many different guys in our room to to make plays and uh, to be a, a factor out there on that on that field. So it's difficult to double team. It's difficult to to triple team and to to play all of this cloud coverage. So it just helps a lot uh, just having uh, other guys on the team that can uh, make plays and and, and to to do something with the ball so it's always great. And Justin, you're talking about the beginning, you don't want to get into specifics, but injury, you're not concer overly concerned? No, nah, not overly concerned. Uh, just a little thigh, bruise, contusion, uh, whatever you want to call it. Uh, something that happens a lot during uh, during football. Uh, just just like I said, just got to treat it up, get it feeling well, and be ready to go next week. Justin, the determination not to get brought down in the open field on that 97-yard touchdown, 100%. like what's going through your head while you're weaving in and out? I mean, I always dreamed of a 90, 95 and up yarder uh, touchdown. Never got that opportunity to get one. So uh, as soon as I caught the ball and I seen all of the open space, I was like, I can't get tackled. It's, it's just a must. Uh, I mean, my whole entire uh, first couple years of my career, uh, I've been getting tackled at the 10-yard line or five-yard line. So I said well, it wasn't going to happen this time. <laughs> Third and 13, right before the half. You know, uh, Sam had thrown the interception before that. And it's over the middle, and Warner's right there. The ball that he put on you for that 15-yard gain, can you talk about that? Wait, say it one more time, I'm sorry. Third and 13, where you got right before the half. Yep. Yep. Yeah. He looked like he put some heat on it to get yep. it past Warner. And yeah, uh, I mean, just again, you know, we, we practiced that play so many different times. Uh, we kind of understood that uh, Fred was kind of going to uh, buzz out a little bit and, and leave an open space for that for that through route in the uh, in the middle of the field. Uh, Sam put it on my outside shoulder to, to protect me from the guys that was to my right and to my left. So, uh, I mean, it's just all about the schemes, the schemes that, that are, are working well for us. Uh, we got so many different guys around the whole entire field for, for, for defenses to be 
uh, you know, difficult to really cover us and to scheme up against us. So, uh, you know, people will probably recognize how they changed their whole entire defense the second half of the game. Uh, so it just goes to show you the amount of work that we're putting in, especially against those man-to-man -man coverages like I, I talked uh, throughout the week. Uh, and we're always confident against those type of matchups. So uh, whenever they pit play us in that man-to-man, -man, you know, we're going to eat every time. Justin, in your defense, spreading the wealth around and playing a great game, giving mm -hmm. you guys those setups mm -hmm. too. I mean, defense played tremendous. Uh, I mean, back-to-back -back games now. Uh, I mean, it's kind of it's kind of going to show uh, the, the guys that we have on that side of the ball are playmakers, uh, guys that are, that are hungry for the ball and uh, are itching to, to get the ball in their hands also. So uh, as long as we we playing with that 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 fight and uh, just that attitude on that on that side of the ball. I mean, all, all of it's going to come together. There was a lot yeah. out there last week. The, yeah, but it was the Giants. That changed things a little bit now that you just knocked off the defending NFC champ for a second here in a row? <laughs> yeah. uh, I don't really change much. Uh, I mean, we, we kind of been said, uh, you know, before the season started that a lot of people didn't really have us on the list. A lot of people didn't really uh, put us, you know, uh, put any type of emphasis on our, type of te on our team. Uh, and we're just going to show, show the world what we have in our building. Uh, we're the only ones that know the type of guys that we have in this building, what we're talking about, what's going on uh, in the meeting rooms. We just got to go in and, and execute our plays uh, and just play, play ball. You remember what your longest TD was before any, any level? Uh, 75. I mean, that was my, uh, the, my rookie year is my, yeah. my longest one. So 74 yarder. Uh, after that, it was only like 50s, 40s. Nothing too crazy. That was that was definitely my longest one. I had to get the oxygen mask after that one. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, what did you think about uh, what Kevin O'Connell is doing on offense, dialing things up seemingly at the right time for the first two weeks? Yeah, uh, I feel like what helps a lot is our run game. Uh, just being able to to run the ball and uh, our O line getting getting the hole and, and AJ just fitting it in. Pause. I'm sorry. Uh, and 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 Ty just really just. It, they, they're great backs. They're, they're backs that really uh, can, can find the hole and, and, and hit it. Uh, so it's, it's going to work time and time again uh, to, to, to mirror the, the run game with the pass game, play action. Uh, it's it's going to be tremendous, especially when we get all our guys healthy. Uh, you know, TJ coming back, JA coming back. So we're we looking good for sure. Justin, you've had some big plays, some highlight plays throughout your career. Just, was this one of the best, you think? Oh, for sure. Yeah. Uh, I mean, just like I said, I mean, as a kid, you always kind of mm. dream of those 90, 99 or 98, 97 yard touchdowns uh, that you don't you don't get all the time. Uh, so just great play, great call at the right time, uh, and a great ball by Sam by leading me and trusting me to beat the double team. Thanks, Thank y'all. Appreciate, appreciate it. Thank you.